Hey, what's up guys? How are you doing? Kevin is back to bring you another ROM review. Today I have um, for you the Jelly Bean version of uh, Sorcery. The Jelly Bean Sorcery. Um, in case you don't know, um, ICS, IC Sorcery, was very popu popular on the um, Galaxy Nexus. Now it's Jelly Bean version and it's running flawless on the GSM version and the Toro version. Um, CDMA version or something mm. um, and this ROM is by far the most most customizable ROM out there for the Galaxy Nexus out of the box you get tons and tons of customization here really cool and I'm very glad to make this ROM review for you to show you all the nice features of this ROM so as you can see here, I've got my stock CM10 lock screen here, but to replace the lock screen circle with a nice Android um, ice cream sandwich Android, who's looking out of um, out of a um, magician hat, or oh, yeah, looks really cool, really really cool. Mm. So replace my carrier label here with Droid Kevin rooted, nice little addition. So guys, let's get into it. I will change language quickly to um, to English. As you now see, this ROM is totally awesome. So let's begin with the notification bar. Pull it down. Got your toggles here can swipe it so guys let's get into the settings of this ROM so this ROM uh, comes with a stock kernel of Jelly Bean um, what you can do is add another kernel so replace it I replaced it with um, popcorn kernel I really recommend this kernel really great battery, battery life and performance so guys what now comes is the Jelly Bean Sorcery Options, they are great, they are awesome. You get tons and tons of customizations. So let's begin with um, the control center, something like um, AOKP ROM control. So, got your, did, got your uh, common settings here. Change uh, the UI. So, enable volume panel, for example, you guys know it. This shortcut here for all. For all um, sounds, allow a 180 degrees rotation, enable kill all button, very nice feature to have. Um, get your clock settings, get your navigation bar, you guys know it, you can set here custom um, custom targets here and on your lock screen. Get your toggles in CM, CM style, Cyanogen mod style or AOKP style. Great to change between those if you don't like CM10, for example, these toggles. Get your LED options, also great way to improve that. I don't like that default setting as 9 seconds, that's too long for me. Um, I don't look um, so often on my phone um, that I can see the LED, so change it to 4.5 seconds. You can test the LED by turning off the screen now, so you can see the LED. Great, so let's continue. So now these are um, settings you all know, you can um, adjust everything. Um, before we get to the Jelly Bean Sorcery tools, um, I run Quadrant Test and reached uh, 7100 points with the popcorn kernel. Mm, I run it at um, 1.35 GHz. Really recommend the settings. I show you now what settings I have set there. I will definitely stick with this ROM. It's version 2.3. It will be updated. But I um, continue ROM reviews, of course. But this ROM is really great. So let's 
let's get to the um, Jelly Bean Sorcery Tool section here. So you guys um, now see that you have tons and tons of features here. You can change an app wallpaper, a pull down wallpaper. This year I changed it to black. Default it's the holo, holo background. So let's see if we can mess with it. I will enable wireless uh, Wi-Fi to uh, make it a little faster here. So guys, you can make some funny things here. You can um, you can change it to yellow, for example. <laughs> that looks really cool. So guys, mess with it. Great features to have. And you can these these um, wallpapers from Jelly Bean Sorcery you can add. Now you are will be restarted immediately, and you uh, it's it's kind of awesome to have these backgrounds here in the notification bar. Notification bar. So guys, you can um, download extra modifications. You can um, um, GPS fix, for example, G apps, Galaxy S3 sounds, app package. You can um, see if something um, that you like, you can download it. So, guys, you can set the lock screen circle here as I may, as I am, um, as I did. Um, Change your battery style, really great feature. I hope this will focus. So I changed it. Now I got the circle. You can change your soft key, soft keys to another theme here. So what we have here is awesome ones such as green neon. Let's let's try it, or um, maybe I have to install zip for that. So when you click OK, it will download it. Oh, yeah, that was really fast. Oh, I have a problem here. What's that? So now navigation bar looks really cool with these green neon icons. Now my navigation bar is gone. Now great. So you can change that mis miscellaneous miscellaneous. So you get other other things there. You can see if you like something um, there. Change the glow dots um, color. Also great. So the, these are all great features to customize to your own liking. Great weather icons you can change on the lock screen when you set weather there. Um, status bar, I ch changed all the icons uh, to white. Love um, minimalistic looks, so as you see here, got no icons here, got my clock here. And this, uh, this theme here for Apex Launcher, I will have a video on that in Android Customs uh, episode 2. I will show you how to get that theme and how it's called and how you set it. Wait till this focuses. No. So get back to sorcery tools. Icons, now modifications. Tra screen transi transitions you can um, set here. Boot animations, two, over 200 boot animations. Fonts of course, pull down wallpaper. App wallpaper, so we were there, so it's um, on the featured as well. Device manager, app manager, push notifications, ROM updates. You can see if there's any update for your ROM. Yeah, latest release is version 2.3. We have installed that.
This is our theme engine. Now we can set themes there. Developer tools, you guys know it from CM10 maybe. So you can see, for example, how much fingers your phone is detecting. <laughs> really great feature to have. Um, Try 10 fingers and the phone kept up. <laughs> So um, what we have here is some um, system, you can block ads, already have blocked ads, yes, cache cleaner, fix permissions, everything here, you don't have to go into recovery to do that, um, kernels, you can choose your kernel from a list, it's, very, it, it, it's always updated and you get your Franco kernels, your Gladys kernels, James Bond kernel, lean kernel, and I have seen popcorn kernel here. You can flash this kernel, really recommend it. Got your um, overclock settings here directly. So CPU speed, current 1.35 gigahertz I've set. Pegasus Q governor, great governor. So as you can see, it's really fast. Now these are all great features. So this one for you who like customization as I as I do. Really love this ROM. Really recommend it. It's really fast when you flash popcorn kernel. Stock kernel is great for battery life, but not for performance. When you play 3D games such as Modern Combat 3, for example. So, guys, um, I hope you liked the video. Um, please give me a, a thumbs up here. And subscribe button you can hit that here and guys um, have a great day I will see you in my next video so um, guys flash this one and um, have fun with your phone guys bye